Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, this is a very random video. So obviously at the beginning of this video, I did like a little mini montage thing. Um, yes, yeah, so that was basically yesterday. It was Monday yesterday, the 1st of May. Like, oh my God, can you believe it's May? I'm so tired right now. I feel so non-enthusiastic. <laughs> But yesterday was my first day at my new job which is so exciting it was actually so much fun we did have a bit of technical difficulties in the fact that one of the clients hadn't sent over the correct audio so i haven't really been able to properly start editing until today but that's all sorted now and i've done like a rough edit rough cut of the videos that i'm making today so yeah it's all going really well it's currently 10 past 12 so basically guys i was gonna do a daily vlog like day in my life thing yesterday of like my first day at work but then it just ended up being a mess because there wasn't really much time to vlog my mum was here like because it was bank holiday it was just all over the place basically guys and I figured that it's probably gonna be a bit boring if I just do a daily vlog because I'm obviously just getting into the swing of things and like once I'm into editing I'm into it you know <laughs> and I just keep going and then lose track of the time so honestly I can't believe it's already like lunchtime so I'm about to go have some lunch I'm so tired right now so yeah, I'm going to do this more like a weekly vlog, but it's just going to be like, I'm just going to pick the camera up here and there. So it's not going to be like structured like it normally kind of is. So yeah, you're just going to get some little clips of my first week at my new job, which is super exciting. So yeah, I want to know if you guys, like any of you guys are actually interested in the ins and outs of these videos but yeah um yesterday i also did some planning and my planner we've got the planner back out guys we are on it the plan for the rest of the day is just to continue editing <laughs> that's literally gonna be my life now um but yeah i'm gonna edit a little bit more of this but hopefully i don't have too much more to do um for today and then i'm gonna i've got a call with the rest of the editors at two today and i think i'm also calling one of my course mates about a presentation we have due in the next couple of weeks. Well, I think in the next couple of weeks, it's literally in like 10 days. It's next Thursday, it's due. And yeah, that's our final assignment. So yeah, and we're a bit confused on what's happening with that. And obviously I need to start getting planning on that because I don't have like full days free anymore because of this job. So yeah, that's quite stressful, but yeah. So far we are on track, which is good. I'm gonna, head downstairs get some lunch and yeah okay guys you join me in the kitchen we are about to make some lunch i'm just gonna okay so i'm gonna show you guys my go-to lunch at the moment which i'm loving i'm so hungry as well so i'm very excited for this but oh my god i've been having a bagel with scrambled egg done in the pan but also not properly whisked up like literally just cracking an egg in the pan and then just kind of like like zhuzhing it around in the pan <laughs> um i don't know why but i'm preferring that at the moment and i never used to do my scrambled eggs in a pan and if i was still having like dedicated scrambled eggs on toast i'd still do it in the microwave but i don't know why i've been loving that recently so yeah one egg cracked into the pan and then bagel which as you can see running out <laughs> then salt and pepper in the egg and a gouda slice on the bagel and then the egg on top it's amazing i will show you guys oh and then ketchup of course because my fave let me show you guys i'm gonna do it and then yeah Okay, so we've got the egg. And I literally just do like this around the pan <laughs> until it's cooked. I'm gonna put you back there for a second, guys. But yeah, I'm just cooking this egg. Um, and you have to do it really quickly. That's why I just kind of like missed that. Um, and I've just done some salt and pepper in it. 
literally is done in seconds compared to like putting in the microwave okay that is that guys that is like my egg all done and then i'm just gonna leave that in there for now that is my thingy done right let me put you we're literally we're doing a step by step bite here guys <laughs> it's actually you have to do it so fast so yeah i'm now just gonna butter my bagel and then a gouda slice i prefer gouda because it melts like more stringy which i love and then to the other side and then you grab your egg and i'm just gonna put it on top of the cheese because then the cheese melts better and then ketchup my fave stunning guys look at that beautiful pop the lid on squash it down a little bit attempt to cut it in half without being too messy with it <laughs> beautiful and there we go guys my egg and cheese bagel sandwich with ketchup beautiful i'm gonna go eat this now <laughs> oh my gosh guys i look a state i look an actual state i am done for today like i i'm literally so done it's 20 past five i've fully been working since like nine this morning just staring at my computer so my eyes hurt a little bit i'm so tired it is unreal it's just been a very stressful day because obviously yesterday i couldn't really get any of the videos edited like i said um, and it's just been like teaching myself again how to use Premiere Pro because I've been using Final Cut for so long. But also like most of the time the things that I edit are quite basic like my vlogs like right now. And so even though I can do all the fancy extra stuff I forgot how long it actually takes. And so <laughs> yeah it's been like a lot trying to get back into the swing of doing all of that again. So yeah I've got... I've got it kind of in, under control I think. I've just planned out my day for tomorrow, done like a really big to-do list of everything that I need to do just to make myself feel a little less stressed about it so I know exactly what I'm doing and I feel like I've got my shit together a bit more. I had my call as well about the uni assignment which I'm also slightly stressed about so we are going to go watch the film that we're going to do now, well I am anyway. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I've got cookie waiting for me downstairs, so I'm going to go eat a cookie. Rue, Rue's being a pain out the window. Um, I feel like I'm going to fall asleep in like two minutes though. So yeah, I'm going to head downstairs and we're going to have a nice dinner tonight. I don't know what we're having actually. I'm cooking it because mum is on night shifts. But yeah, I thought I'd just have a little catch up guys. Welcome to my reality right now. Oh, now you're wonky. I've got my little planner back out guys, super cute, pop that away for now, it's a lot, it's a lot, I can't wait to go to sleep tonight honestly, like I'm so tired, um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go chill now, well, kind of doing work, because like I said I've got to watch a film, but it's, it's gonna be okay, it's gonna be fine good evening guys so it is now half seven i've just well i've just put my skin and me on i've started using this again i don't know if i mentioned it or not but i used this last year and it completely cleared up my skin and then i stopped using it because my skin got good again but then a couple months ago i had the worst breakouts ever so i decided to hop back on it and i'm using it again and you guys can already see like i think it was literally only like my last video or the video before that my skin was horrendous and i was so self-conscious about it and i was like oh my god like i don't even want to be on camera right now with it but now like it's pretty much all cleared up it's just like a bit of scarring there's like there's a spot here um there's kind of a spot there but other than that it's all flat and it's just scarring and it's doing really well so it is honestly skin of me like you need to try it if you haven't already this isn't an ad i did pay full price for this but you get given a code with every purchase so mine is actually on here it is i'll leave it on screen it's kira and also in the description it's kira s 
8U9N. So basically if you use that, you will get one month free of the Skin of Me, which is £24.99 per month, so that's a really good deal. And I will also get £10 off my next order. So it's a win-win. But honestly, this saved my skin and I told my sister about it and my best friend Lucy and both of them use it as well and love it and they've completely cleared up their skin with it too so highly highly recommend but anyway I thought I'd just have a quick little catch up because like I said it's the evening and my head is just on work like this is the thing that I've been warned about um with remote working um or like working for yourself that kind of thing because your brain doesn't switch off like it's so hard right now I know that there's so much that I still have to do and I just want to do it I'm one of them people that I will literally get everything done in one go because I hate having deadlines I hate being like close to like the deadline and being like oh my god stressed you know like I stress so much so I'm the kind of person that just gets everything done in one go and then I'm bored afterwards because I'm like what do I do now because I've done it <laughs> but I'm trying to pace myself with this and like I really want to just grab my laptop right now and keep on editing but I'm like no Kira like you've literally done like eight hours today please give it a break so I'm gonna wind down by doing some coloring I've got an adult coloring book and it's like my favorite thing to do like I really want to get back into reading which is something that I still need to get back onto but I feel like my brain just hurts right now like my eyes kind of hurt they've been straining all day I need something light that's away from a screen as well so I'm gonna do some adult coloring because I feel like it's like the best thing to do it's so therapeutic um and yeah so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do the rest of my skincare now you've just got to wait 10 minutes after the treatment before you do the rest of your skincare but yeah I thought I'd just have a little catch up I'm gonna make some dinner in a minute I'm um, ready for when mum comes home and yeah tomorrow I am actually going out tomorrow night although I say this a lot in my vlogs and I'm like oh yeah well I didn't end up going out. I do actually have something fun planned tomorrow I'll let you guys know if it actually happens because like I said you guys know me and um, it's not always my fault FYI <laughs> but my plans do tend to fall, fall through quite often but that should be nice and a nice little thing to just like get me away from work and relax. But yeah, it's also really good that I do have the office though. Sorry, I'm chatting way too much right now. It's really good that I have the office now. Um, just purely because it then differentiates like my living room, my bedroom and the workspace being the office. So that is another good thing if you also work from home. But anyway guys, I'm going to go now <laughs> and i'll catch you guys probably tomorrow good evening guys so it is wednesday today 3rd of may and it is actually now four o'clock i have once again been sat at this laptop all day editing i look a state um but yeah i'm gonna call it a day here because i am getting picked up at six to go out which is very exciting i'm actually going out guys oh my god so i need to get ready for that but also i just there's something I'm waiting on to finish my edits, so it's not really a big deal. And then I can just do that a little bit tomorrow and submit for review. So, yeah, that is how my day's gone. So now I'm just going to basically, we have like a daily project update where like every single day you write in what you've done. That sounds like my dog's just thrown up. Um, are you okay down there, whoever that was? I should probably go check. I think my dog's just thrown up. Oh, you okay, Raymond? No, he's just thrown up. Okay, um, Raymond, you all right? Okay, no. <laughs> okay, back to what I was saying before I got rudely interrupted by my dog throwing up. <laughs> I've just been cleaned it up. Um, so anyway, <laughs> so yeah, basically I've got to write down what I've done today. So I'm going to do that real quick. You can watch me. So what have I done today? Hello, baby, you're not feeling well. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear, Ray. Um, yeah, I know, baby. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> it's so cute. Okay, so that's that done. That is today's done. Amazing. So, I'm done, guys. I'm done for today. 
we're gonna turn this off. What are we calling it a day? Oh my god, also guys, I got a really cute dress. Basically, I think I said, yeah, I said, was it in this? No, I think it was last week's video that I am up for an award with Rebel again this year. Last year I won their best video and got runner up for project engagement or something like that. I can't remember what it was called exactly. But yeah, that was really fun. And so I didn't want to, basically the only dress I have that's appropriate for the awards evening is the one I wore last year. And I want it to look slightly different in the photos. I don't want people to be like, she's wearing the same dress. So I got a, another one from Pretty Little Thing. Oh my God, it's so cute. However, I got it in a size 10 and I was basically, I was going to get it in a size 8 because I'm very thin. Like I've got a small bum, small boobs. I do have quite big hips, but yeah, I'm very small. I'm very flat. So I was like, I'll get a size 8, even though I do get size 10 in like most things, like my jeans and stuff. Because like I said, my hips and that. But I was like, no, I'll get a size 8 because I'm very flat. And yeah, um, but then this dress it was sold out in a size eight, but it had every other size. So I got a 10 thinking, oh, it might be a little bit too big. It arrived today and I put it on and I could barely put it on. Then once it was on, I could barely breathe. And then I could not get it off either. <laughs> but it's so cute. But I, I'm sorry, but honestly, a size four to six would not even fit in that 10, I swear. So I ordered a 12 and I don't have a 12 in like anything unless I get like oversized t-shirts and stuff, I get a 12. Um, so yeah, but that's coming tomorrow. So hopefully that fits. If not, I'm gonna just suffocate myself for the night because it's so cute. Um, but yes, that's exciting. I will sh I should have showed you guys it on because it was really cute. But you know, and I need to really sort myself out because I've been playing with my hair a lot today and it's now got even more like greasy. And I wanted to wear it down and I'm going to put some more curls in it tonight. So I'm hoping it doesn't look too greasy, but I think I can sort it out. Um, so yeah, I just want to go and chill a little bit now. Relax. Probably do a bit of my colouring book. <laughs> Maybe have a cup of tea. And then I will get ready to go. I'm so tired, honestly. Right. Let's go. We have just got ready to go out. I'm gonna give you a quick little show of my outfit. Okay, for some reason we cut off, but here is the outfit. I'm not sure on these jeans, to be fair. I think I say that like every time I wear them. But they're from Primark, they're still cute. Um, new Converse's, little white top, and I have got a little like cropped jacket to go with it. So let's go play some mini golf. <laughs> hey guys, so it is now Friday and it's half six. I have just washed my hair, done my skincare, all that good stuff. Um, but I just realized I did not vlog anymore since the other day. So I thought I'd just have a quick little catch up and finish off this video basically. So Wednesday night, I did end up going out. We played, I went and played mini golf and then went for food, which is really nice. And then I came home and then yesterday, I literally only had a few little bits left to do of my video edits for the week for work so I did those and then I worked a little bit more on my uni assignment and I submitted my videos for review. They then got reviewed last night and today being Friday I literally only had like the smallest little thing to change on the videos so I was I went to Tesco's this morning and then yeah submitted the main videos and sorted those out so I'm all done for the week now um which is very exciting and I've just been packing a little bit because we're going to the caravan this weekend because obviously it's bank holiday weekend it's the coronation and all that jazz so yeah we're going down to the caravan having some food um and all that stuff so yeah we would be going down tonight but my mum's on night shift so she doesn't really want to drive like late so we're going tomorrow morning like super early um so yeah i'm packing the majority of my stuff tonight and then yeah i will be back to work on monday i think i'm coming home kind of monday lunchtime so i'll be working a little bit at the caravan and then the rest of the week here and next week's honestly such a busy week it's ridiculous but 
yeah i thought i would just finish off this little vlog so i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did make sure to smash the thumbs up button also make sure to check out my social media which is on the screen now and subscribe if you haven't already but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you all very very soon with a new one bye to the morning